Hey, what's going on guys? So this is gonna be answering one of the questions I get the most at our baseball facility. And that is, hey Mitch, how do I tighten the fingers in my glove? So this right here and this right here. So we're gonna be going over two different types of finger lace jobs. So the first one's gonna be our little double tie knot up here. So this is seen in a lot of Wilsons. Um, for Rawlings, it's usually typically up here just a one knot it goes all the way through so there are two different ways to tighten the glove and two different ways to release it so I'm gonna go over both for you guys today so basically the tools you're gonna need are pliers that's pretty much all you need a pair of pliers you don't sometimes you don't even need that so if you're out on the road and you can figure it out that's fine pliers just make your life a whole lot easier all right, so this is gonna be our traditional way of doing things. So this is this is a Mizuno glove. It's seen in Rawlings. It's seen in so many different gloves. So this is gonna to apply to most of you guys, I'm sure. First, we're gonna start right here in the knot. We're gonna untie it. So, And so when I do this with the pliers, I'm actually gonna be trying to grab this fat part right here. And because when I grab the top of the lace, I'm gonna discolor it for one. So right now I'm working with gold lace. And if I get the side of it, I'm not gonna be affecting any of that. So it will look the same as before. So there we go, we got the knot out. And basically we're gonna start from this side right here. So let me loosen up the glove so you can see how it works. All right, there we go. So the laces are all loosened up right now. I'm just gonna show you where to start. So I'm gonna flip the glove around so it looks a little bit uh, more normal for you guys. So I always start on this inside finger. So right here, basically I'm gonna follow the lace around through the back, and now I'm going to the back side. So what I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna pull it, pull it out, pull it tight, go to the front side. So now I'm just gonna follow the leader basically. So now I have this lace out. I'm gonna go to the back side. So that's right here. Pull this, pull it tight. So there we go. And basically I'm just gonna follow the same pattern all the way around. So there, pull that out, go to the back side, pull this one through. There we go. And you see I just keep continuing this pattern until it's all tightened up. So here we go, it's all tightened up. All we have to do is tie this knot together. So basically for the knot, I'm just gonna make a little circle here, put the lace through, follow it through. Right. So I usually like guide it right against the leather here to make sure it is tight as possible. Keep it against that leather. And then now, I just tighten it. So there we go, that's the knot done up. All perfect. All right, now, Wilson's, um, very similar concept. You're gonna have the two laces up here. So I'm just gonna loosen them up right now. So we have these two laces right here. This bottom one is gonna be controlling this whole top part. Okay, so what this lace does, it comes from here, goes up, 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 and then from here it goes down into the glove. So we're starting it off right, right here. So this one goes from there to there, around the back, through here, and what it's gonna do, it's gonna come through the front side of the leather. So usually in the other one, it went through the back side, so the normal one we went through the back side, but you see how we leave that right there? So there really is no lace on the outside. So I'll show you the difference. See, there's lace on the back side. That's where that one comes through. This one is coming through the front. So right here, if that makes sense to you guys. So basically, I'll show you again. So we're going right from here on the bottom. This bottom part goes to the top. This one goes all the way across the top. This is coming from the top right here, around to here, through the back up here, through this lace, through the top part here, so it literally just going through the front part of the leather, and then down through the back, up around to the top part of the leather, down, round, right to here, and then it ends up at our other starting point. So basically, same concept as the other glove. All that happens is we have this extra lace that goes across here, and instead of going from behind, they're just going through the front. Hey guys, I hope that video helped you guys out a lot. I'm gonna be having a pretty big update coming up this week. So this is gonna be about a trip that we're going on in December. So I'm really excited to tell you guys about this. It has a lot to do with baseball, a lot to do with charity. So 
It's going to be an awesome time. Anyways, guys, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you guys on Wednesday. And as always, keep on swinging.